Oh, hey there. Yeah, we're living her up today, bud. We're gonna get the old grill ski fired up and have ourselves a tasty little meal. So why don't you just step on in? The water's just right. First, we got ourselves some carrots we're gonna roast up. And so next, we got ourselves some potatoes here, bud, and went ahead and just mixed them up with a bit of onion and threw some butter in there for good measure. Yeah, and so next there, we got ourselves a uh, Copper River salmon. Got, uh, you know, lemon on the wife's half and no lemon on the good half. And, uh, you know, last but not least, here we got ourselves a steak, nice old ribeye here. Went ahead and uh, seasoned it up a bit and made sure to put that Montreal steak season on there. That's just going to take it right up a notch. And uh, if you haven't uh, realized, you know, butter is going to be a, a common reoccurrence around here. You just put it on everything. And if you're wondering why the steak's wrapped up in tinfoil right now, well, I got a whole other video on why that's a purpose. I'll link it down at the end. Okay, so she's cooked up to about 550 Fahrenheit, or as I like to call it, the old sweet spot there. So go ahead and just toss on them uh, potatoes and carrots. And uh, let's see, it's going to be all oh, about a half hour or so till they're ready. So we'll just keep ourselves entertained in the meantime. There, Chief. She's all we're ready tossing the salmon now. Give that 20 minutes. You know, 10 each side. Remember to flip. Remember to flip. You know what the most underrated fruit of all time is? You know, nice good old fresh cut lemon bud. Oh yeah, it's good stuff. Oh, we're just stuff her in the beer, huh? Oh, 15 minutes left there, Chief, so steak time. And uh, you know, while we're at it. Uh, I guess these other guys just flipped over there. Well, our half hour's done, bud. We are ready to go here. Just uh, getting loaded up. Uh, you see that right there? She just cooks up right in her own juices, bud. And now we just have ourselves the uh, feast of the frozen gods over here, man. Mmm, mmm. I woke up today knowing it was going to be a good day. <laughs> 